the rss believes that india is one idea and we believe that india is a multiplicity of ideas and we believe by the way very much like the united states we believe that everybody should be allowed to participate we believe that everybody should be allowed to dream every should everybody should be given space regardless of their caste language religion tradition history this is the fight and the fight was crystallized in the election when millions of people in india clearly understood that the prime minister of india is attacking the constitution of india because what i am saying to you union of states respect to languages respect to religions respect to traditions respect to castes this is all in the constitution every single word that i have said to you is in the constitution the foundation of modern india is the constitution and and what people understood in the election clearly and i saw it happening when i used to raise the constitution like this people understood what i was saying they were saying that the bjp is attacking our tradition attacking our language attacking our states attacking our histories and most importantly what they understood was that anybody who is attacking the constitution of india is also attacking our religious tradition right and that is why in my first speech in parliament you must have noticed when i describe abhay mudra this the fact that this is a symbol of fearlessness and it is present in every single indian religion you can look you go on the you go on the internet and you can see every single indian religion guru nanak ji holds his hand like this shiva holds his hand like this every single indian religion the hand is a symbol of fearlessness and when i was saying this the bjp could not stand it they don't understand and and we are going to make them understand you see and the other thing that happened the other thing that happened that was very beautiful that in fact i was amazed that it happened so quickly was that fear of the bjp vanished disappeared gone and we saw that immediately within within minutes of the election result nobody in india was scared of the bjp or the prime minister of india so these are these are huge achievements not of rahul gandhi or the congress party we are peripheral these are huge achievements of the people of india who realized of democracy of the people of india who realized that we are not going to accept an attack on our constitution we are not going to accept an attack on our religion we are not going to accept an attack